Captain, I... No good way to say this without sounding like bragging. Got a comm call from Ward Mantell, Governor's office. They've been keeping tabs on what we're doing, and... Captain, they're calling me a Republic hero. Ward Mantell's most storied native son. You are a hero, Corso. I'm glad someone's acknowledging it. It's not like they're building a statue or anything. Actually, they're asking for our help. Turns out the Separatists were backed by the Empire. They wanted to destabilize the government. When they were defeated, the Empire attacked outright. Ord drove them off, but they left behind some kind of EMP pulsar. What's that do? It's causing every droid on the planet to malfunction. Apparently, the thing is in orbit somewhere. They haven't been able to get a lock on the signal. But it's affected every droid, comlink, and terminal on the planet. Complete economic shutdown. How do we help? Thank you, Captain. It'd be nice to give something back to the world that raised me. They're asking us to go to Balmora. The Empire's got disarm codes stored there, but Ord has no troops with the gear or training to go after them. Do we know where on Balmora? The codes were stored in a cave with a bunch of other Imperial weapons. Should be a quick snatch and grab, as far as should takes us. Magar! Magar! Answer me! We've been waiting for you all clear. Are you there? Blasted Imperials! Who's that? Why would she be calling an Imperial soldier? If they killed you, Magar. Huh? I've already sworn to hunt down every puss ridden Emperor lover on this planet. Hello? You're not my husband. Why are you answering his call? You first. Why are you calling this man? Oh, blast it! One of us will have to trust first. You don't sound Imperial. I'm Dan Lazine, proud Balmoran and member of the Resistance Against the Empire. My husband Magar stole an Imperial uniform. He and some friends were trying to get weapons to help us retake our town. Stole a uniform? They weren't really Imperials? Free Balmorans, everyone. Did... did anyone survive? I wish they did. I'm really sorry, ma'am. I wish there were better words for it. Is there any way we can make it up to you? You're gonna think I'm a cold-hearted old battle axe, but I've lost my sons, my parents. That's no stranger here. What we really need are those guns. Magor risked his life to get them. I hate to think he died for nothing. Can Ord Mantell wait on these codes long enough for a side trip? Captain, these men died because of our mistake. Bring me the guns, and I'll pay fair price for the lot of them. We're in hiding behind Imperial lines. Magar's comms got the coordinates. So, you're the ones who killed my Magar. You look younger in person. It can't have been easy to get these guns here. Thank you. Now, what do I owe you? Danla, darling. I just heard the terrible news. It's a tough time for a woman to be alone out here. 
But don't worry. I won't let anyone take advantage of that. This guy a friend of yours? I'm with Tat. This is my town. And those are my guns you're returning. From my men you killed. Our debt is to the lady. Aren't you too sweet? But this is my army, not Dan Lazin's. Whatever she's offering for those munitions, I'll double it. Guessing you've got a strong opinion about this. There's no amount of money that would make me give this brute a blaster. Ma'am, you still interested in buying these weapons? Thank you, son. You're a good boy. I hope your mama appreciates that. Now, you move on out. We don't need you anymore. What? This is my town! You're no better than the Imperials. Go see if they'll have you. We'll take back Balmora on our own. You've got a minute, Captain. I've got something on my mind. I knew your whole only in it for the money thing was just a front. Thank you, Captain. I couldn't live with myself if we left Dan Lazine with that pig. Hardly makes up for killing her husband. She's probably not the first widow we've ever left, Captain. You just gotta hope it all evens out, you know? Governor's office on Ord Mantell says thanks, by the way. With the disarm codes, they finally got real peace there. It's hard to say if something like that is worth a life. Look, Captain, I try not to get sentimental around you, but hear me out. You're the best thing that ever happened to me. You're my family, as much or more than the one the Separatists took. As long as I live, I'll be here to serve you, and your children after if I last so long. I wouldn't want to try any of this without you. You're a good friend, Captain. And seriously, keep that children thing in mind. You've got too many talents not to pass them on. Every kid needs an uncle who's good with a DXR6 heavy carbine.